everybody, this is Kara, aka The Principal Painter, and today I am very, very proud to announce, as you saw from the thumbnail, this is a Diamond Art Club sneak peek. Oh, I got another one. I'm so excited. I always get so excited when I get word that I've gotten one to share with you. This one will be coming out tomorrow, March 12th, uh, again, 9 o'clock, uh, Pacific Standard Time, 10 o'clock Mountain Time, 11 o'clock Central, and 12 o'clock Eastern. And then 30 minutes later, it will come out. And I'm sorry, the 9, 10, 11, and 12 times uh, in those time zones are for Diamond and Ruby members of Diamond Art Club. And then 30 minutes later, i.e. 9, 30, 10, 30, 11, 30, and 12, 30 in those same uh, time zones for the general public. This is one that I saw and was asked if I would like to unbox. And you guys know I love color and I love whimsical and I love different. So I jumped at this one. Love it, love it, love it. Um, for those of you that may be new, this is a Diamond Art Club box. As you can see from the blue stripes, blue stripes mean it is a square diamond painting. There is a square on the front. I'm not going to show you the image yet and keep you in suspense. Uh, there is a square here that says square diamonds on it, so you know that those uh, diamonds are going to be square. Also on the box, never pay full price for a Diamond Art Club image. They want you to uh, get money off, percent off. This is just one of the many ways that you can get money off uh, this particular painting or any other painting that you may want. You scan this QR code and you get 10% off. There's also a code on your packing slip and uh, some other places, including on the canvas that I will show you momentarily. I am so excited about this one. This one also got a lot of comments and a lot of excitement when it was released because again of the colors. I think Diamond Art Club is trying to kill me with the colors. Uh, let's get it out and see what we've got, shall we? Okay, I'm hearing stuff. I'm hearing stuff. Okay. First of all, I have my login sheet, and I'm not going to keep you in suspense too long before I show you this amazing image. I did get a uh, standard toolkit. Diamond Art Club, as you know, is coming out with their new toolkits. However, they are phasing them in. These toolkits, these standard toolkits uh, that they've got, are absolutely fine. It's got everything in here that you need to diamond paint. As you guys know, uh, when I do sneak peeks, if I'm ever privileged to do any more, I will take a little bit more time on these just so you can see everything you're getting. You get a bunch of baggies, which is great for extra drill storage or if you wanna kit up this way. I'm not sure if there are enough baggies to kit up, but if you wanna uh, store spares, you can do that. You get two plates of heart wax. Make sure again, you pull off, there's plastic, a little bit hard to see pull off your plastic to expose your wax so that you get your wax in your drill pen or else you're getting nothing in the drill pen you get a pair of tweezers make sure you keep the sheath on them they are the pointy stabby kind make sure you don't poke your eyeball out and keep that sheath on there for safety uh, you get a clear boat with a funnel which is always very convenient for pouring your drills back out a pen with a squishy a diamond painting pen for extra comfort. It's normally a couple of multi-placers. I got one, which is fine. I love this size multi-placer. It is a four-placer. And if you look very carefully, it'll say it on the multi-placer that you get from Diamond Art Club. That will be great. What'd you get, Kara? What'd you get? Let me show you what I got. I got City Digs by Carla Gerard. And I learned a little bit more about Carla Gerard. Is that good? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, this is a, an extremely colorful and whimsical image. I cannot wait to do this. It is a cityscape, and that's why it's called City Digs. It is, again, it is, it is a square diamond painting, 22 by 28 inches or 56 by 71 centimeter, which means it's a little bit larger, but it's not uh, not too, too big, which is perfect. You can peel this sticker off, put it in a log book or on your box if you store your uh, diamond paintings back in your Diamond Art Club box so you know what it is. Shall we look at it? They're trying to kill me with these colors, guys. Trying to kill me. All right. 
Every single Diamond Art Club painting comes in this plastic sleeve to protect the canvas, which is great. The back of the canvas, this is a tarpaulin canvas, meaning it's very, very soft and buttery on the back. It does have a scalloped and surged edge to prevent fraying. And what a tarpaulin canvas does, it is a softer canvas. There's no other company that has this type of canvas in the market. What it does is if you roll it back, and you can roll this back because the material on the canvas is poured glue. I am already dying over these colors, guys. Already dying. I'm gonna roll it back, and the tarpaulin canvas helps it to roll back and, uh, and flatten out momentarily. I'm gonna park this here, show you a couple of other things. This is a step-by-step -step instruction booklet. I've noticed that with the new toolkits, you'll get uh, a different step-by-step -step instruction booklet, but it still has all of the information that you will need. Tips and tricks to diamond paint, a thank you from the founder, Angie Shahe, and another 10% off uh, coupon code and how to diamond paint, which is very nice. So that is awesome. And you get a big sticker. This thing has 44 colors in it. And are you ready? They're trying to kill me again. If you remembered the last sneak peek, I had six, six ABs. Guess what this one has? Six, six ABs. Again, you can tell on a Diamond Art Club whether it is an AB or not if these numbers are under 150. So I have 100, 104, 119, 120, 125, and 131. We're gonna be looking for six ABs in this, folks. And here is that gorgeous image. I love this whimsical, colorful image. Um, also, you can use this. This whole entire sheet is a sticker. You can cut this out and use it. Some people like the bigger image more than the smaller image. And you can put your start and end date down if you would like to. And every single one of these labels on this is... Uh, they're individually pre-cut, so you can just pull them off, put them on your containers. They do come off your containers very easily, and you uh, don't have any goop or gunk. Also, at the bottom, they have white individual labels, so that if you have anything else to label, you've got some extra stickers there. So that is awesome. All right, are we ready? Let's get into this. I want to see it. I want to see it. Oh, oh my goodness. Okay, I'm going to have to hold this up. Marlon, make sure they can see it. And we're going to pan over this for you. Look at how gorgeous those houses are. I love this. Again, it's colorful. It's whimsical. You have different types of architecture in this. Um, I know a little bit about Carla Gerard. I've done some homework on her. I always like to try to find out a little bit about the artists for you in Sneak Peek so you know a little bit, bit about the artists. Uh, Carla Gerard is a self-taught artist, meaning she did not go to any art schools, what have you. She taught herself um, you know, all of the artwork that she does. All of her artwork is like this. It is very whimsical. It's very colorful. She does have a website where you can get all kinds of cards and pillowcases and bags and all kinds of things with her different pieces of art on it, which I think would be so fun. Uh, if you'll notice on the canvas, there is a schematic on both sides of this canvas on the top left and bottom right with all of your colors and symbols. And if you will look down at the bottom here, you've got a thumbnail of the image. You do have uh, the title, you have the artist. Also, does Diamond Art Club legally license their artists? Absolutely, yes. Uh, everything that they do, they pay their artists for, which is great. Again, it's got the dimensions and uh, branded. And at the top it says, do what makes you sparkle. Diamond Art Club. And speaking of sparkle, another feature of this canvas is it does have sparkles in the canvas with all this color. It's kind of hard to tell, but there there is sparkle in the canvas without even putting the drills down, which is phenomenal. Just makes it so much more fun. I'm gonna peel this back. Uh, this clear cover is thicker, I've noticed. And let's get into the canvas. Marlon, can you show them those symbols? Pan them way in way in. Look how clear those symbols are. Again, 
darker uh, darker writing on lighter colors, lighter writing on darker colors. I've never had uh, an issue with blurry symbols on a diamond art club ever, ever, ever. And um, it just, again, makes the diamond painting process so much more pleasurable. Again, this is a square. Um, you will also notice that I really, really like about these canvases, whether it is a square or a round, is there aren't any lines so that if you don't line up something completely perfectly it's very hard to tell what I also like is the background is colorful so when you lay your drills down if you see a little bit of the canvas in between the drills you're not going to be able to tell because the background is colored which is very very nice I love this image oh again different colorful it and you can see how quick this canvas is laying flat I didn't have to do much to it at all and in true typical Kara fashion, there goes our little sticker sheet on the ground, but I will pick that up. Okay, we will flip this back over and look for where those AB drills are. Kara, what are AB drills? AB drills, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It is a special coating put on the drill and it picks up the light, it captures the colors uh, in the environment around it and the drills beside it and just makes them all together now, shim, shim, shimmy, shimmer just a little bit more. By the way, if you have just happened upon my channel and are new, I would really appreciate you hitting the like button and the subscribe button so you see more unboxings like this. I am gonna put up a whip and chat either tonight or tomorrow for my collab with Angie the Craft NATO. And so we do all kinds of stuff on here. I do throw in a little bit of extra DIY things from time to time, but mainly I am a diamond painting channel and I'm glad you're here with me. This is so exciting to be able to do this. Okay, just at first blush, look at these colors. They are killing me, and I'm already seeing some ABs, and it looks like we have uh, a, a good quantity of ABs, which, again, there's six of them, so we should, right? Let's get into these. These do come in trains. First train to Georgia. Here's 100 right off the bat. Your first AB, which is a beautiful lime green. Can they see that? Make sure they're seeing it. All right, and you can see that coating. I'll give you an example. Here is 471, so I won't have to show you 471, but you can see the difference. And if you can pan them up so they can see that coating, you can see the difference between 471. These drills, uh, the plain drills, are super sparkly, but these uh, do have that special coating on them. So that is 100. We're gonna have a green. And 841, 37, Oh, I'm just a color person, so this is exciting. 838, 3817. Oh, 797, that's gorgeous. 333, which is another purple. And I'm twisting and turning here. 3864, 961, a beautiful pink. <clears throat> 3766. We have two bags of 3766, which is a beautiful blue. 807, which are getting more into a little bit more turquoisey. You have got three bags of 900. We're going to really be seeing, obviously, a lot of that color. 471, which is another really pretty green. And 125. And I did lie to you. I said I wouldn't show 471 again. Well, I did. Sorry, I lied. 125, bing, bing, bing. Here is your next AB. There is a lot of it. It is, looks to be white, but it does have the faintest hint of like a mint or a lime, not lime, a minty uh, seafoam green, but you can barely, if you gotta really look at it for a while to see it. So there's that beautiful coating on that. Next train, next train. Here are the smaller trains, the baby trains. I'm out of order, but that is okay. We don't care. We're going to see them all. 632, 3809, 550. Here's the next AB, 119. Gosh, again, six ABs. Never thought I'd see six ABs again, but here we are, 119, that beautiful purple. And you can really, on the darker ABs, you can really see that coating well on the camera. Sometimes you can't. 519, 334, blues. 3347, 368, 3816. Lots of beautiful greens in this one. 976, 327. Here's another AB, folks. 120. 
That is a beautiful blue with that coating on it. I can't wait to see where these go. We're gonna flip this back over and see where it goes. 783, 798, look at that beautiful purple. 3350, 3760, 3371, 3810, 3746, I love that. 3855, okay. We are going to have some three tens in this. We went away unscathed on my last sneak peek, but we are going to have some three tens. And obviously from this image, it is needed to make those color colors pop. Three ten is black for those of you that might be new. 644 taupe. Look at 947. That is a gorgeous orange. 3811, two bags of that. And 407, a light, light caramely brown. Last group, last group. Okay, and I'm already seeing our last AB. Oh no, last two ABs. Oh my gosh, look at this. So 740, and if that wasn't beautiful enough, 131, here is your next AB. It is a beautiful, more yellow than orange, but it does have a little bit of orange tint to these. 104 is a peach. I don't know that I've seen this color. I keep seeing new ABs and all these kits because Diamond Art Club has upped their game with the AB uh, with the AB stuff going on, which is super exciting. Um, love that peach color. And 741, which is a beautiful, again, more orange than yellow, but it does have a tinge of yellow in it. Let's see where these go. I want to know. I want to know where these ABs go. All right. Um, you have one, the symbols, okay? So you have symbol one, symbol two, symbol three, symbol four. Um, number five, which is your 125, is a sideways line. I'm already seeing it in some of the windows. And 131 is a basically a yellowish orange square with a dot in it. So let's look for ones first. I'm already seeing some of these other colors. One, one, one. Okay, so we've got some ones. In the window, make sure they can see this, honey. In the window over here, all in this house, that's where all your ones are gonna go. Let me see if there, there are ones in these windows. Where else? I don't see any other ones. I'm looking in the rooftops, I'm looking in this because it's got a lot of green in it, I don't see any. All right, two is two, and again, I'm seeing it in this window. I am seeing two in this window. This whole shading on the side of this square is two, two in this window. Like the other one, guys, these ABs are gonna be everywhere. Okay, do you see this little roof on this house? The little, uh, looks to be, you know, taupey colors. That's all two scattered in that green. Um, 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 if I didn't say that, in all of these windows, that is one. Trying to think. I think that is it for the twos. Oh no, there's twos in this roof. Yeah, so I'm looking in the roofs to make sure there aren't any more twos. I want to be, oh my gosh. Okay, so in this, what looks to be a mandala on this, I don't know if this is supposed to be a little garden behind the houses, but it sure looks like it. All of the, that peach color in there is all two, all of it. Windows here is two, two over here. And, and two in this window over here. And I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. I don't see any other twos. Three is three, which is purple. Let's see, three in these windows. Three in this window. Um, just making sure they can see it, honey. Let's see, other threes. The three, uh, the purple bag was a little bit smaller, so we're probably not gonna have as many. I'm looking in all these purple areas to make sure I'm not missing any threes. I don't see any that I'm missing. Oh, yes, I do. Oh, yes, I do. In this house right here, or townhouse, or whatever, condo, whatever you wanna call it, all the lavender that you see in here is all three. Wow, this is gonna, these colors are gonna be scattered everywhere. Four is blue, and I saw some fours right off the bat. Where did I see them? I'm sorry, I have an old brain. Things go in and out of my brain very quickly. Four, four, four. Oh, don't tell me, I'm gonna miss it now. Okay, so you got fours in this window here. You have four in this door. You have four in this window. Um, 
Let's see where else I put some more. I'm looking, I'm looking. Try not to miss anything. Sorry, I, again, this is gonna take a little bit more time. Four in this roof. Anywhere you see this bright blue is all four. Over here, nope, don't see any fours over there. I think that'll just about do it for the four. Uh, four, again, if I haven't said it, four in this window as well. All right, sideways slash. Okay, it's the, uh, can they see this symbol right here? That's what we're looking for, that sideways, I don't know, sideways slash or fraction sign. Everywhere you see white here, it's all in these windows. Anywhere you see white, anywhere you see white here, anywhere you see white here, here, all in this mandala. Everywhere around it is all that slot. That's going to be an AB. These windows, sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself because I'm so excited. This window with all the white in it, it looks to be anywhere you see white. It's going to be your ABs. Oh my gosh, again, this one is going to sparkle and shine like no other. ABs, 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 um, ABs in the windows, ABs in, in the door down here in the windows. I mean, this is going to, in this flower, the white outline in the center of the flower, all the outline all around the leaves and the stem. All of this is going to be anywhere you see white, it's all going to be a B. This is crazy. Wow. All right. And six is the dot. Are you ready for this? Everywhere you see this bright yellow color, that's all going to be your a B, your 131. Let's see where else. All in these leaves. Looks to be like uh, leaves changing colors in the fall. Um, actually, this kind of reminds me of spring, but all of where you see yellow is all going to be your AB in this window, all of it, AB, all of this roofing, um, the shingles on the roof, all of the yellow you see is AB. The petals, you know how I love my sunflowers. I'm going to call that a sunflower, but um, all of the petals, the, the yellow in the petals is all AB, this window. All of the yellow in this window is all AB. Guys, they're gonna be everywhere. Diamond Art Club, you're trying to kill me with the ABs. This is, in, this is incredible, seriously. Um, again, my last two unboxings of sneak peeks, I've not seen this many ABs. This is gonna be unbelievably colorful and shimmer and shine. I love the fact that it is whimsical. I love the fact that um, she is a self-taught artist. Uh, she may or may not be new to Diamond Art Club. I'm not sure of that uh, fact. But again, she is from Water, uh, Carla Gerard. She is from Waterville, Maine. And um, she has been selling her art worldwide and on Etsy. She is on Etsy. She's been selling her art worldwide and on Etsy for over 19 years. Uh, she does like to work in oils and acrylics. And she likes, she calls this abstract and folk art. I call it whimsical, but you can see uh, that this would be folk art and um, abstract as well. I love this. What this reminds me of too is my parents uh, used to live in San Ramon, California, which is close to San Francisco. And we went out on a boat ride and there was a hillside, obviously above the water, with houses that looked almost like this except obviously they weren't abstract but they're extremely colorful and I thought that would be such a fun place to live and walk out your door every day and see all these beautiful colors it would just make me happy list in the comments below I know these houses are very close together but would you live somewhere like this um, or do you like to be more spread out I'd like to know that. Um, and again, have you been to San Francisco and seen this scene? Because it was really beautiful. I, I really appreciated that. But that is what I've got for you today, folks. Get on there. Grab this one. It is not a limited edition. I will tell you that. It is not a limited edition. But there are some sneak peeks coming up that are. Hint, hint, hint. You might want to be watching this weekend. Just saying. All right, guys, that's what I've got for you. Marlon, can you do me a favor and pan them over this canvas so they can see the whole thing? I want them to be able to take that in. Got it? Can they see the whole thing? They can see the whole thing. Oh, good. Okay, I am so glad. 
I want to thank Diamond Art Club for giving me this opportunity and sending me this beautiful image. I just love it. I love colorful. I love different. I love whimsical. Uh, but if you do too, tomorrow morning, uh, 9, 10, 11, and 12, I will be putting the time zones down in the description box so that you don't have to memorize it. Uh, or if you forget, you can uh, can look it up. I, I know people appreciated that the last time, so I will do it again this time. Thank you so much, Diamond Art Club. This is absolutely beautiful. I love the colors. I love the whimsy in this. And again, this is something that would go with just about any decor. Uh, I have a farmhouse theme. It's got sunflowers in it that would go with the farmhouse. If you're more modern, it's got that vibe to it as well. But yeah, this reminds me of that beautiful home scene on the hill in San Francisco when we were on our boat ride. This just makes me happy, guys. I mean, how can these colors not make you totally happy? And this is gonna be so much fun to work on. All right, that's what I've got for you. Get on there tomorrow, grab this. There are also some other beautiful images that other uh, creators are unboxing for you and Diamond Art Club. Also, what I wanted to tell you too is Diamond Art Club has a VIP group on Facebook where they do release images of these new releases uh, every week to kind of, kind of as a teaser before we unbox them. So make sure that you have joined the Diamond Art Club VIP Facebook group and uh, you'll get all the latest and greatest on what's going on with them and uh, what they're releasing. So that's what I've got for you. I hope everybody has a fantastic weekend. Thank you again, Diamond Art Club. This is outstanding. And I'll leave you with this. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. This is the Principal Painter, and I am signing off.